Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you about how to install the Sidon software over the Linux distribution which I'm using the Ubuntu 20 with the name of Vocal Fossa as ever just go to github.com and search here my name again I'm going to search my name Nima Dolatsabadi and uh, just press enter with the results there will be no result because I'm a user so change the filter to users here and uh, the first one is me just click on it and I have lots of repositories here that I'm following or created just select the first one with the earthquake seismology you can see it has many branches uh, about eight branches you can see the branches all here just go to size on here and you can see the size and branch here with the folders and the size and config that takes which in this file i'm going to talk about it after downloading so just click on the code the green button here and download zip it will download this branch to your download folder so after that i'm going to find this file uh this is the file here and uh, just i'm going to extract it here extract here uh I, if i go inside i can see the files here so i'm just going to change its name just for my modification and uh, it is changed to size and let's get into the file inside this i have uh, gave you an information about installing in four parts the first one is saying go to sizan the com directory and change the things in length of uh, sizan to your sizan home directory what is this high sizan home directory the directory which you go inside the sizan is your sizan home directory so i'm just going to copy the address here uh how did i do it just press on the keyboard with the control l and it will be highlighted here i'm just going to copy with the control c and go inside the com directory and change the size and that bash here the size and that bash the 16th line is size and under and top equal to the pass to size and home so i'm just going to paste what i copied earlier and just this nothing more in order to size and working you need an old library of uh, libgfortran.so.3 and uh, in order to do that you just need to go to size and lib, uh, libgfortran and choose a directory due to distribution architecture and do the following uh, what, what I mean by uh, distribution ar architecture I just mean that if you are using a uh, 64 bits or 20 uh, or 32 uh, bits architecture uh, if you are using uh, Ubuntu 20 you are just only having the uh, 64 bits distribution architecture and uh, you just need to let's do what it says go to lib yes i have libg fortran here i have a uh, 64 bit architecture here and i have this file just open a terminal here and uh, copy this one here i have did this before so i'm not going to do it again i'm just going to show you sudo cp because it is a root directory i need uh, i need to be a sudo user and copy the file to this directory and everything will be done just at the following lines to back to your bash rc let's see what what we have to do i'm just going to copy all of them here the bash rc is a file in your home folder uh if you press ctrl h uh, you can see the hidden file hidden files have uh dots in the first of the root name i have bash rc here i'm just going to scroll down uh, I have size on here, but I'm going to do it again to s for you to see. Uh, like here, I'm going to copy paste those uh, files, those uh, lines I have copied. So 
Another thing here is the on a hashtag is uh, meant for commenting. The first line is saying size and home pass to size and home. I just need to go back here to here and press Control L and size and home is copied. And everything is done. You don't need to change anything at all. Just save it here. Uh, we do not have any work with this one. Uh, I'm just going to get back to it. So what you need to do is uh, just open a new terminal and source the bash RC. Uh, maybe I have command source not found. Maybe I have made a mistake. I'm just going to bash RC. Uh, yes, this has to be like this. I just copied something. Uh, the first, I just copied the first letter here. Uh, it was like this, so I just edited. Uh, it must be lowercase, and it is done. If I open a new terminal here, uh, there will be no problem here. Source the bash RC. I need to make the bash RC to, to be read again. And everything is done just by pressing the WA. You just go to wave directory of the size and software. You can see download temporary size and WA with the wave name. Uh, all the tools are working here, like wave tool. I'm going to uh, change uh, format of file to the size and uh, I'm not going to do any other editors. Uh, nothing and um, the output format for me must be sec and the output file is in the sec format here i can see this is uh, with the sec format if i have sec installed i can go inside the sec and uh, just read it and plot it and we can see the file here i'm just going to remove them i don't need it and everything is done if you uh, are going to have some problem with wi-fi some uh, institutes are still uh, publishing the wi-fi uh, they start with y uh, in the first letter uh, you need to have some other libraries installed as you should go to number four if you need NAND save for a specific usages, do the following. First, install patch up. Uh, how to install patch up? Just open a new terminal and uh, type sudo apt install patch up. And my password here. Uh, it is installed. No, it is not installed. I just, I just installed it right now. and you will install it after you install it just go to size and leave nmx here uh, i'm going to close the hidden files just let's go what it says the number four go to size and leave nmx size and leave with the nmx i have it and do the following print replace needed uh the the file is uh, modified to my own to my system it has my name and my directors you need to change it to yours so you've got to put the pass to your size and home here uh, like let's just uh, let me just tell you that you just open a new terminal here and uh, do the following let's just do it so you can see what I'm going to say just like this, you need to change it to your size and home directory. So I'm going to get back here. Press Control L, copy the address and paste the address. And just by pressing Enter, everything will be done. Uh, you need to do again the go to size and pro. There is a module with the Wi-Fi dump, and uh, just do this again. Just do not forget to modify pass to yours with the your size and home directory and again you have to do this for your size and home directory and 
everything will be done just open a new terminal and uh, go to your home you can see I'm home and uh, uh, just make the batch of it to be read again uh, I'm going to read it it is done and uh, NAND save module is just working right now if I am having a Wi file I can turn them to size and files uh, size and formats uh, as you you might heard somewhere that Nancy only works on Windows uh, it might be removed just right now due to newer version of size and because no institute uh, is going to use Wi-Fi but a system of them are publishing Wi-Fi waveform so you might be in need and I have some I have uh, prepared some packages and made them usable for Linux and you can use Nancy here uh, if you download Sizen from Sizen if I type Sizen earthquake here the first link here if you go to download it uh, there won't be any module like Wi-Fi dump as I uh, as I as you see here that you need to modify it to your system there is no Wi-Fi there is no Nancy I just modified some for your good and everything is done uh, you have completely installed Sizen to your Linux distribution good luck